Hello friends, welcome back to the Domain Racer and here we are going to share you the steps to get the license key of your LMS Tutor Pro. So how do you get the license key? Here we are considering that you have already downloaded Tutor LMS plugin and installed into your WordPress. If you don't then please watch the video given in the description and then now time to get the license key from the Domain Racer. So how do you get the license key? We must have to know some things. Very first. Uh, before requesting a license key please consider these two things first install your ssl certificate from cpanel if you don't know how to the link is given in the description second install your wordpress and tutor lms plugin and to download the tutor lms plugin you can go to the domain racer and you can download from there once both the part completed you will get the installation of WordPress and Tutor LMS and you can say a partially built website where you just need to apply the license key and the further customizations you can do later on. So now how do you request the license key? For that you just have to go to the domainracer.com and log in and create a support ticket. And here you just have to enter the subject I want the Tutor LMS license key for my domain and here you have to give some information. So what are those informations? Stay with this video so we will give you the answer. Here we have to share the URL. URL nothing but your website link where you wanted to install the LMS license key. Please make sure that this is a very sensitive case. Let's give you a few examples. So here very first links has a various variations. So the examples are here. First one is HTTP colon double slash your domain name dot com. Second same but it added www dot third it is a subdomain abc dot and in the fourth you can able to see that it is installed in sub directory means like courses folder so similarly if you have did any one of that kindly make sure that here while sharing the url do not share the wrong url because it's a very case sensitive always give if it is http then give http not https if it is HTTPS, give HTTPS. If it is www, then give www. If you wanted to install on subdomain, then give subdomain where your WordPress has been installed. So do not confuse us. So please do not give a wrong URL because if license issues, it is issued to particular URL. So it cannot be used for the another URL. If it is HTTP and you are requested for HTTPS, it will not work on HTTP. So similarly, so this way you just have to enter here, sir. Hello, sir. I have purchased your plan. Uh, I wanted to get the license key for this particular URL. So in this case, our team will give the license key. If you are just contacting, they will ask you the same question again and then you have to properly give the response and you will get the license key. Please make sure that if you give the correct URL then our team will easily give you a license key. Now there are few questions comes in the mind. The very first can I change the URL after issuing the license key? Yes you can able to change. Can we cancel license key? Answer is no because once the license key is issued we already paid to the license provider so now it cannot be cancelled. So please make a note of it because here if you are building a business and in that whenever we need a licenses so that time these licenses are a final one. So if you need any help we are available 24 by 7. Now one more question can I uh, get a multiple license key the answer is no because each license keys we have to pay to the license provider we have to pay a fixed amount of money to a license provider and it is very costly for us but we are trying our best to give the best quality and highest services at a very minimalized cost to our customers so this is how you can able to get the license key and you wanted to know how to apply the license key the video is already given so just go and watch this videos but while sharing the URL do not do any kind of a mistakes. I will give you some real time example. Suppose here it is a subdomain. You can able to see here that it is a HTTP. So in this case just copy this URL and give to our support area. So they will give you a license key. The another example is here. Okay. This website is HTTP with WWW. So I have to just copy this URL and give it to the support.